Oh my goodness, YouTube, what's up? You know what it is already. Man, I was looking at Facebook, some, and they talking about some guy's going to be the, the king of R&B. What's his name? Jaquiz? Jaquiz? Never heard of dude, but he said that for this generation, I am the king of R&B. I was like, what? How disrespectful. How dare you say such a thing? Of this generation? This is still Chris Brown's generation. Still. You the king of that? I don't see how. The boy could sing. I give him his props. The boy could sing. But you're not the king. And when, when he said that, he went viral right away. People were just attacking him. Because he thinks he's the king. And you got little Bow Wow supporting him. And people like, who the heck is little Bow Wow? Who is he? He ain't nobody. His career long gone. He's vouching for you? Ain't gonna work. I have nothing against neither one of them two. But my thing is, he said he's the king of R&B. Of his generation. Like, how old is this dude? 20-something years old? You ain't that far from Chris Brown. Chris Brown, what, 30? 29? You're only a few years apart. And you talking about this is your generation and you're the king of R&B? Stop it. People like R. Kelly and all these other veterans jumped in was like, no, absolutely not. Not even close. Not even a little bit. You're not the king of nothing. Over Chris Brown's dead body you are. Somebody commented and said, Trey Songs and Chris Brown. They better than this dude. If anything, one of them the king of R&B. Ain't no one of them. It's CB. He's that dude. Too many number one hit songs. Too many hits. Too many of this. Too many of that. That's the. He is just this generation's king of R&B. The queen. I, I don't know. But. And then as I saw his one video on, on Facebook. They making fun of this dude. Jacquees. They making fun of this guy. Because he was singing while he was in the car. And he kept saying this stuff over and over again. And people were just bashing him in the comments. He talking about some he and his feelings. I need somebody to listen to. Somebody to listen to me. I called my sister up. I figured she would listen. I need somebody to listen to me. Yeah. To me. Me. E -e 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 ooh, ooh. I was dying laughing at the comments. <laughs> What's funny? It was roasting that dude like, dude, this is uh, 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 annoying. And that you need to shut up, uh, 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 up. They was on this dude. Tough. Talking about he the king of R&B. If you don't stop it. <laughs> <laughs> he said he the king of R&B. Woo. That's disrespect to Chris Brown, man. That's disrespect to almost a lot of people. Even Tyrese, the, the Fast and Furious guy, even he commented on it. It was like, what? He went off. They say he took down his Instagram post, but when it was up, he even mentioned Chris Brown. And he mentioned Trey Songz. I When I first heard it, I went, so what about Chris Brown? That was the first thing I said. What about him? You, you, you better than him? You the king over him too? Stop it. Just stop it. Dude can sing. I give him his props. I ain't hating on dude, but he's not the king. I'm sorry. You're not even the prince, let alone the king. You're not even the prince. Yes, I said it. You're not even the prince. I'm just saying. Like, comment, share, subscribe this video. Tell me what you think, man. You think Jacque is the king of R&B? If so, drop a comment. We can debate, argue, whatever it is you like. Let me know something. Out.